Hello, good morning, happy Monday. I am going to walk you through, I think a couple days in my life studying for the MCAT. If you've been with me on my journey, you know that I've been sharing what it looks like for me to be studying for the MCAT. I've just been full-time studying. So today what I'm planning on doing is I actually think I'm gonna get out of the house for the beginning of the morning and actually go to a coffee shop to do some content review just because I like having a little change in scenery sometimes. So I'm gonna go there, study for a couple of hours and then I'll come back around probably lunchtime. Lazy Sunday mornings hiding under covers I don't mind staying in with you Play your favorite movie Playing right beside me I don't mind when it's just us two The corner coffee shop we like to go Okay, so I'm now back home from the coffee shop. I was there for a couple hours. I made some avocado toast for lunch. It's kind of like breakfast though, because I didn't eat this morning. All I had was that latte at the coffee shop, so that's the perfect yolk. Okay, I made a little apple peanut butter snack because I was still hungry after eating the avocado toast. I finished the chapter of Orgo I was working on at um, the coffee shop. So I'm just going to do the questions that are at the back of the chapter and then I'm going to move on to the next content. Okay, I just finished up those Orgo questions. I actually did pretty well. I got two wrong on that. Um, practice set so i'm gonna go ahead and go over all of them but just make sure i know why i got things right because i did get some right that i struggled on so like for example uh number seven I put a star but i did get it right i always like to go over those that i'm not 100 percent on because it shows that i'm not fully competent on the material just yet so i'm gonna go over those and then uh, we'll continue on to the next subject So I'm going to review some physics questions and do a chapter of physics. like 4 30 i just um watched physics videos i also did my hair i was straightening my hair while i was watching physics videos just because i was kind of um not taking notes on them i was just relearning some information i really really struggle with physics and i have struggled with physics since undergrad so this is nothing new i think what i'm gonna do now is just work out just to kind of get some energy back
Jump up. Reset. Core's in. Lifting up. Now it's loaded as much out as good. The lift more timers in charge, not me. But if I keep saying it, then you do it. All the way. Here we go, SWAT team. Do not drop all up. Hey, Ryan, I told you before. It's 5.30. My sister made dinner, so they're gonna be home soon with the kids. I just finished my workout. My ears are like ringing. I don't think I ate enough today and I'm like very lightheaded right now. So I need to get my heart rate back to, my heart rate's at 135 right now. I have about 45 minute workout. I need to end it, but it was a great workout. I just think I needed to feel myself a little bit better. But he likes liquor and cocaine I like playing with his brain Or maybe I'm just fake I like looking at the stars He likes playing with my heart He knows just when to start Okay, the kitchen is clean. We're done with dinner. It's about 7 o'clock now. Want to go for a walk? Yes. We do. I'm wearing my sister's hat. Nothing gators today, baby. And look at the Christmas tree, it's so pretty. So pretty. He likes the way I walked in. I might just say that I popped in. Yeah, maybe this is fake. You're so cute. You puppy. So cute. <laughs> Ready? Get it. Oh, I bad throw, sorry. Get it. Oh, good boy. Look, watch how he throws it back. Watch how he throws it back. Watch how he throws it back. <laughs> You're so cute. Ready? Get it. Oh, good catch. My goal is definitely to shift my bedtime a bit earlier because I just want to wake up in the morning and feel very refreshed and I literally never feel that way. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I ever will, but I just want to get to a point where I know it's not because I went to bed later than I should have, I guess. So yeah, I'll keep you updated. It's about seven. I just made breakfast for the kids, so they'll be eating that soon and then I made myself a little something. We didn't have avocados, so I literally just have like butter toast with eggs, but totally fine. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and eat breakfast. My goal is to get to the coffee shop right after we walk the kids to school. It's 11 and I just made this bowl of oats. <laughs> it kind of looks like overkill with the apple, but the bowl is just like small. It's a whole apple. There's oats, hemp seeds, chocolate chips, and peanut butter. Looks pretty good. I'm hoping this will help me get some energy for the day because yesterday I felt really faint during my workout and I think I just didn't eat enough. I'm gonna go ahead and do these practice questions and see how I do. Okay, I just finished those questions. I got five wrong. <laughs> kind of a lot to get wrong, but yeah, I definitely need to go over these answers and just see kind of where I went wrong. It wasn't like I got them wrong without being confused. Three of these I had stars on that I got wrong. So stuff I need to definitely review for sure. And I'm gonna do that now. This is goodbye. Red light didn't wanna let you go. Okay, 
I just finished reviewing the chapter questions and I feel decent about it. Doing some physics today. Oh, I'm already intimidated. Can you believe? Can you believe it? I already don't want to do it. I get very discouraged when I'm doing the book problems and just like reading through the book in general because the chapters tend to be pretty long and it's just like kind of boring reading all of this. I actually found a um, website that has kind of like a more comprehensive guide in terms of what you need to know for um, the physics section of MCAT and it brings up a really good point here is that physics doesn't really physics is definitely not the most high yield topic on the MCAT so I don't want to spend so much of my time like trying to remember trying to know every single thing about physics from this book when I really just have to focus on the high yield topics look it says this comment here is important you can expect to see 12 to 18 physics questions out of 230 total questions on the entire MCAT. So it doesn't really make sense for me to put the same amount of time into physics as I do for like biochemistry, for example. Um, so I actually think I'm, over the next couple of days, I'm going to go through some of these and see if it helps me compartmentalize things a little bit better and feel less intimidated by stuff. So I think I'm going to start with this section and, and see how I like it. I will link it down below if anybody else is interested. It's Taco Tuesday. Every Tuesday, my sister's been doing a variation of tacos, and it's been really nice. So it looks like we have ground beef today, some bell peppers, tortillas, all the good stuff. All right, it's that time. Time to walk this dog. Mm -hmm. 